Hello there everyone. Now I've been getting a lot of questions recently about the mods I've been using in my recent videos and I thought I'd take a little moment to explain them all to you. So, let's get started. To start things off, I thought I'd address the HUD. This is the EVE HUD. It's amazingly sexy. I've basically used it in every single one of my videos. It's super amazing. By the way, all the download links will be in the description below if you didn't see that little thing back there. Next up, we have a custom-made Dead Ringer animation slash open-click thingamajig. I actually kind of half-made it myself, basically only the sounds and stuff, but I'll put a download link for that as well in the description. Let's move on to the next one. Here we have custom animations. Now these are absolutely beautiful. These are all basically made by the same guy. He's absolutely amazing and I use it for basically every single class that I can. As you can see, the shooting, the reloading, the opening, every single little thing is animated, even the disguise kit. And of course, the backstab animation is different. Look at how he expertly raises it up and then does a little hack and sash. Woof! Oh man, that is absolutely beautiful. Let's move on to the next one. Ah yes, next we have the Engineer. Look at how amazing this is. He breaks it out. Also, this is a side note, I also use the Rocket Wrist. Now doesn't this thing look amazing? It's like the Gunslinger, but many times better. This one also has completely custom animations. Let's move on to the next one. Just because I don't want the entire video to be about custom animations, I also use them for the Heavy, Medic, Scout, Soldier, and Pyro. Awesome sauce. On to the next bit. As seen in the Spot the Hacker finale, I do use the Fem Pyro, and I I honestly can't figure out what exactly makes me just use the Fem Pyro model. It's, there's, there's something about it. I just I can't put my finger on it, but it, it it's got to be something. I don't know. If you guys can figure it out, you know, leave a comment, but I can't figure it out. Next up, we have custom particles. Now, these are absolutely the sexiest thing I can recommend. It's just, oh, so good levels of looking awesome. Along with muzzle flashes, there's also the Righteous Bison. Oh, it looks amazing. And of course, there are wonderful explosions. And believe it or not, there are also custom critical animations. Look at how amazing that looks. The rocket trail plus the explosions plus the criticals. Oh, majestic. Now before I wrap up with a final little mod, there is one I'd like to show you. It's the Stanley Parable Mod Announcer Pack. It basically takes the announcer pack from Dota 2 and puts it into TF2. And it's just so humorous, so amazing. I really recommend it. Another thrilling match awaits us. What do you think will happen this time? Murdering one another, probably, yes? Unless, yeah, no. No, I'm going to go with constant murder. Just so you know, I'll be taking a shot every time you die. Please try to keep me out of the hospital. 30 seconds until Digital Sports. Well, guys, that's pretty much it. This was just a nice little showcase and maybe a little bit of a filler video while I work on the next one, just to show you mods that I use and how amazingly sexy they are. So, yeah. All the mod links will be down in the description below. I strongly recommend you get them. However, most of them cannot be run on SV Pure 1 or 2 or 0, whatever the fuck the stupid rules are. But yeah, enjoy the final little explosion mod. Good. Holy butts!